about sure. so, you know, a buyer yeah, agency? So now you've got to wear the buyer's hat. So you're looking to buy a house. And by the way, when I started my career, I was a buyer agent. So that was where oh, okay. we started our business. So I love to work with buyers. And I, you know, every weekend I'd have three, four or five different couples in my car on a, each each day, each Saturday and Sunday. And I just enjoyed that process. And, you know, they all became friends. And a lot of them today are still, you know, lifelong clients and friends. So, but the key with a buyer, I think, is you really want to make sure you educate them. So. If they're a first-time buyer, you want to make sure they understand all the costs, all the ways they can save money. And, you know, we've talked about this before, Rav, but, you know, the biggest mistake a lot of realtors make is they're just, you know, let me show you three houses, pick one, and, and off you go. And, you know, they don't even know what their costs are. They don't know how they can save money. They don't know anything, really. And so we typically, before we get out of the gates, we really want to spend an hour and kind of, con you know, it's a consultation of sorts to make sure they're fully aware and apprised of what they're up against. And if it doesn't make sense at that time, then we're going to revisit it six or 12 months down the road. Maybe they have some tarnished credit. We've got to repair that. So we'll, you know, recommend So you'll help so us. So, so I can't necessarily, once you've sat down, because a lot, you're right, a lot of people take people out. They want to put in an offer and they don't even qualify for a mortgage. Yeah. And if, if that realtor would have done their due diligence for both parties' sake, right. you know, um, then we could, we could see where they're at.